What does a Chinese zoo, a bear who stands on his hind legs and waves, and humans have in common? Nothing! According to the Hangzhou Zoo in China, it seems a four-year-old sun bear has been giving zoo-goers their money's worth as she stands upright on her hind legs and waves like a human. Of course, once this made it to the internet, skeptics were quick to claim hoax, citing it's a human in a bear costume. And while the zoo stands steadfast that it's a real bear, the zoo has seen a 30% uptick in attendance since going viral. Is this a well-orchestrated publicity stunt? Is this the next evolution for bears? And who do you think would win in a fight, a bear or a thousand salmon? <laughs> see the way I seamlessly, I seamlessly uh, tuck that one I right in there. See what you did there, Jeff. See I've been wanting there, to discuss this for a long time, and I'm psyched that you guys are the panel to do this. <laughs> really? So, Tim, mm. I'd, I'd like to kick it off with you if that's okay. Okay, let's just recap this real quick. A thousand salmon. A thousand. Okay, versus a bear. One bear. In an actual fight. Absolutely. Who's the promoter? Do we know the promoter? Don King. Don okay, King. Don King. Okay. okay. Who's going to win between a thousand salmon and a bear? I, I'm going to say it won't even take 500 salmon. Ooh. Yeah. Really? Not even a thousand. 500 salmon can take down a bear. Really? This is a bold take. A bold take. Yeah, easy. I mean, have you ever gone camping? If there's a thousand gnats, you're done. Yeah, but it's not you like can't, they're not You're not surviving. They're not piranha, they're salmon. Yeah, but they just you just you know, a okay. thousand paper Wait, cuts. Wait, how did they go? <laughs> <laughs> you know? <laughs> I used to train salmon. Oh, look, yeah. Good. Okay. yeah, yeah. It looked like it was from experience. Yeah, it was yeah, experience. It yeah. Doug, are you gonna are you gonna take this on or do you need I, me to hop in here? I well I know my answer already. All right, go ahead. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm I can wait. sorry, you know how much I care for you, but <laughs> I'm gonna go with um, a bear easily. It's a bear. It has nice. claws. They're huge. They're massive. They like they eat salmon regularly. I don't think I've ever seen a salmon eat a bear. So um, I'm gonna guess that the that the bear is gonna be like dinner time. I'm coming back for breakfast. You Lunch. say you like, haven't seen it. it what could, a it, salmon it, eat a bear? Yeah, you. I have not how seen much it. camping have you done? Very <laughs> close to zero. Uh, <laughs> in, in other words, zero. That's a hard zero. zero. Th th I'm still going with the bear. So I'm gonna I'm gonna tap my. Tap out. Oh, you're tapping one. out too. All bear. right. Well, this is where I jump in. The seasoned camper, the Eagle <laughs> Scout, the one who the nature boy boogie. <laughs> I'm hopping in on this one. All right, I've, I've, I've camped a thousand times in my lifetime, lived by the Sierras, seen bears in the wild, mm -hmm. seen salmon in the wild. I have manhandled many salmon in my life, but I've never manhandled a bear. Therefore, I'm going to say the bear is going to take not one, not two, not a hundred, not five hundred. The bear can take a thousand salmon wow. easily, not without easily. a Whoa. doubt. And I am speaking from experience, being the wilderness man that I am, check the beard. No pocket square today. Yes, no pocket square today, <laughs> so I'm coming full of rugged boogie. Uh, bear, bear easily could take out a salmon for, 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 for several reasons. Salmon's mouth, about yay. Bear's mouth, about yay. Bear's paw and claws, about yay. Salmon don't even have arms or claws. They got little feet, feet, feet. That's not doing nothing to a bear, but I'm saying, <laughs> I, uh, I'm saying bear. Hold up. Bear. Okay, okay. He's, I'm, he's, I'm, he's, these two have tapped out. You're still in done, it. Done. I, I'm still in it. I'm going to give a Cliff Notes version of your story. <laughs> Boogie lives in a van down by the river <laughs> and lives off of ranch dressing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, Buttermilk King. You got Outdoors. Me. <laughs> Come on. No, All right. Okay, I, under, I know where you're coming from. Bears and salmon does look like a fair fight, but I'm sorry. Strength in numbers. Yeah. I, I, I wish I could quote Yoda right now. Right. Quote he, Nemo. Here's the thing, I know as, as my job is to just moderate this and host this, but I do have a lot to say on this matter, and I, I want to jump in on this because I'm in agreement with Tim. You got a thousand. Yes, a thousand, a thousand salmon? It's not yes. even that many. A thousand you, but you're, you're thinking, I think, here's the thing, I think you guys are thinking that the salmon need, no, 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 no you punched out. So you <laughs> zip so it. Did she. You, you, did, 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 did. Right there. <laughs> The salmon are going to get up under the, the bear's feet, knock it all off balance. The salmon don't need to be biting and eating. It's They're going to get that bear underwater and drown it. It doesn't matter. No, it does no, matter. No, 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 There's no, no, no. a thousand they're, they're of them. They're not going to drown a bear. First of all, hey, they're not going to drown a bear. I'm sorry, didn't you punch out? Ah, I shouldn't that's have right. done that. I learned my lesson. That, that's why I... That's just um, I'm just imagine the scenario, which I've been through. You're walking down a hallway. <laughs> someone throws a racquetball at you. Okay, no problem. Boo! Okay, you're walking down the hallway. Someone throws a thousand racquetballs at you. You're on your way to the hospital. 
He might be disoriented. I'm, I'm, I'm tapping back in. There's something called guerrilla warfare. <laughs> Since when where can you make the up your own rules? Army can beat the bigger army. I tap back in. I'm sorry. I made the rules. This, you, you can't just make warfare. up your own the rules. The smaller army beats the more the, the, the larger army. The, those salmon come into okay. the bear's territory, which they can't even breathe in. Bear can hold his breath. I'm done. Leave you're me alone. done. You're I'm done. done. You don't know what Should you're talking about. You don't know what you're talking about. It's There's a thousand no salmon. Here. There's bears. There's clearly a lot here that needs to be discussed. We've heard what all of us have to say, but what does the public have to say on the matter? Let's take a look at the poll. We polled everybody. Oh, and, oh, 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 no. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. The, I never thought I would say this, but the public is wrong. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 50 percent of you went with bear, 49 percent salmon, and there's that other one percent that could have been on our side. We could still we could still sway them. Over there, buddy. All right, so we got for the people who agreed with the public, we got these beautiful uh, edge uh, over the edge tokens. Let me get them both. They're about as uh, there's about as useless as a. I'm not cool. See, if he threw a thousand of them at you, you'd be like, ah, I'm injured. We catch a ton of them. Don, 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 pass, pass it down. You hear that? So since they got the the tokens um, for agreeing with the public or the public agreed with them, however you want to look at it. All I know is you guys are in the wrong.